<laughs> Hello, everybody. Guess what it's time for? It's time for a hashtag adventure. Adventure. Yes, we're going to take another adventure today. We are going to do the underwater sea adventure. Underwater sea adventure. I'm not sure it's a real adventure. I think you might be just. I, I don't know. We'll, we'll, in the ocean. <laughs> <laughs> if we have to figure out what it is, I have no idea what to expect. Shore Excursion recommended this, so hashtag Shore Excursion, so hashtag Carnival Adventure, hashtag we have no idea what this is. Hashtag so. I'm pretty sure it includes water. Well, just a quick heads up. Whenever we do call your excursion to exit the room and to head down to the gangway, also make sure whenever we do call. All right, we're off the ship and we are walking down the dock now. Here we're getting equipment on. Look at you. I got a crossing guard uniform on now. He's hooking her in. I don't look too bad. Wow, look at my hair. Good night. I can fly. Look, you got wings. No, those are Jeez. horns. Those are wings. My those horns. horns. My horns. So, anyways, we got done with the deep water, the un underwater, underwater sea adventure. 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 And let me tell you, it was really, really cool. The, the, the description inside of the shore excursion magazine does not do it justice. If you're going to come here to Costa Maya, um, it's really good. We actually got down to 30, 30, 35 feet underneath the water. It's really cool. You can see some of the videos that I'll put up with this, but it's really cool. 
it's like having the scuba diving experience without having to actually learn how to scuba dive. So yeah, it was really good, really good. So we're gonna rate the excursion. Underwater sea adventure. This was an excursion in Costa Maya, Mexico. And it's, um, it's an unusual adventure. It's kind of like learning how to scuba dive without having to actually learn how to scuba dive. You go underwater. This particular one went to, I think, 35 feet. Um, but you leave the tanks at the surface and all you take with you is the, is the hose and the mouthpiece and the goggles, of course. Um, so it simplifies things for people who don't want to take the time to learn how to scuba dive. Um, this one was $79.99 per person. And we spent, I think, a total of about a half hour underwater. So um, for value, I'd probably put it, oh, somewhere around a three. Um, it, $80 for a half hour underwater. Now it did also include an open bar. Um, the one caveat to the open bar was there was only one bar on the beach that, that was part of this and the lines at that bar got very, very long. So you sort of needed to order all the drinks you thought you were going to need for the whole afternoon at one time. <laughs> so that was kind of a drawback. So I would say a three. Um, the excitement level, being able to go 35 feet underwater without having to carry a tank around was actually pretty awesome. We did see a lot of cool things. We saw eels. Um, so the excitement level was actually pretty high. I would put it up somewhere between a nine and a ten. So this excursion I would say was something along the lines of this. Um, if you've always wanted to see the underwater world go deeper than snorkeling but didn't really have the interest or, or the time to learn how to scuba dive, this is a great alternative.